my name is Spiro Vigliotti. Join us as we unpick the threads of our creative fashion community, always remembering our values of nurturing, being commercially savvy and extraordinary. It's a crazy place filled with fun, passion, dedication and so much laughter, which we love. <laughs> So today we're setting up for the launch of the Radisson Red. We've got two of our students who are displaying their collections for the launch. Very excited to be back and we can't wait to see what this evening has in store for everyone that's going to be joining. So follow along and let's have fun. I finally found everybody. Um, I'm making my way through to the room now. We are at room 706 and let's go inside the room and see what everyone's doing. Hi. Hey Joshi, how are you? Yes. Nice to see you here. That's nice just to in, see you. Just, yeah, in, just in time, time to help us dress. <laughs> <laughs> well, see, you've already got one girl up and ready. Yeah, just waiting for you to do the next one. Well, I'll help you. <laughs> yeah, it's not difficult at all. Just avoid all the gaps. Um. <laughs> Hello, hello. Hello, how are you Josh? I'm good, thanks. How good, are you? Good. It's good to see you again. Thank you. And we're helping our darling Tamea. Don't mind me, you came in at the worst time. We all remember Tamea from our previous episode. We're just trying to help this poor lady get <laughs> she's disjointed. She's a bit backwards. Contortionist. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> How excited are you to be showcased? It's very exciting. The hotel is beautiful, like the whole scenery down low, and it actually matches my collection with the red, so it's quite a lot. It does, and, and the concept with each room having its own little story. I know, it's insane. It's like a whole little museum on its own. We're just trying to remove this woman's leg. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think I have it. Okay, there we go. No, it's not. It's just one. Okay, okay, there. Yes, there. Okay, so now let's push this up so the crotch can be where it should be. Oh my goodness. Missions. Oh. Okay. Do we have it on back? Have a look at this outfit. But let's see the bathroom. And slide open the door. Voila, how cool is this bathroom? You know, a little disco man doing his break dancing. The shower. This is the room that we are setting up in. And it's quite an extravagant place, I'd say. So hello Jesse. Hey Joshi. How's it going? <laughs> I'm fantastic. Working hard. We've got lots of show planning happening. Yeah, I've noticed. Thanks for inviting me to do this show. I'm very excited. And the Radisson Red, what do you think so far? Oh my beautiful. I love this room. Um I was a bit sad when the bed wasn't here. I would have loved to take a nap. I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I know it's very beautiful. I like the whole dark environment they've created. So we, we, we had an interview with Tamea earlier on, on our YouTube channel mm -hmm. and she told us the inspiration behind her collection but I would like to get some details about your looks. Oh, about this lovely trap I've created. <laughs> <laughs> so my um, collection was inspired by tribal tattoos and I wanted to create my own surrealistic um, print and went about a few different ways of how to create that and then at the end of the day decided in creating the actual panels um, and incorporating that into my pattern engineering process and that's how I ultimately created the entire collection with a bunch of triangles and shapes all joined together. Okay, what fabrics have you used? So, I've used a pleather, a plastic coated lycra, um, I've used it in pink, mint and then gold and then for my finale look I've encrusted nice little studs on to the, some of the gold pieces uh, just to create a little bit of bling and then as you'll see like in this look here I've created some fringing just for some beautiful movement and this was um, one of the trends when I did my collection at the time so I incorporated fringing 
uh, along with my patchwork or panelling. Okay, amazing. Yeah. And tell me, how do you feel your collection is fitting for the people that are joining at the Radisson today? Definitely clothes that someone can wear, even when they want to just go to the, the rooftop and have a little cocktail, be like the eye of the show, um, or even if you just want to go to a, fin a fancy festival or even a fashion show, some fancy event that can be held here. It's very upper class and high fashion, so I definitely think with the upper class market it does fit with the clients that would be seen here. Oh, and these hat pieces. Thank you. This is the showstopper. Um, not one of your items you'd be wearing every day. <laughs> uh, definitely just for that wow moment if you want to be in your own little music video or photo shoots happening. You know, if you're creating nice cool little covers for your events um, and you want to just have that extra fancy pinch on the top. Amazing. Thank you, Jess. Oh, thank you. <laughs> and Tamea's collection is coming together. Now we get to see it in person, not just on video. Although that video was amazing and the video editing and all of that was fabulous. Who is the person again? Uh, his name is Theo Muda. Theo Muda. Yeah. Theo Muda. And he put that video together. You can have a look at that previous episode. I'll put a link in the bio. But look at the face masks. The earrings, the accessorizing, and the red is just so perfect for the hotel at the moment. We are getting ready to, we're waiting for our models. We're going to be putting clothes on live models for this event as well. Oh, and Tamea's collection is going down the runway this year. On a scale of 1 to 10, how excited are we? Oh my god, 13. <laughs> 13. It's been a long time coming. Yes, so all of this is going to be going down the runway on the 30th of November. And we are so excited to see what it's going to look like. We have hired some fierce girls. Oh, I need them. We've got some fierce girls and they are huge. Not huge at all, I mean. <laughs> <laughs> they are gigantic models. And they're going to do your collection all the justice. How excited is this mom for the show? Very. Been I'm waiting for a, for a long time yes, for this. Hey? Yeah. Very and it's long. always it's, it's it's so disappointing we don't have the opportunity at first, but very, now yeah, very disappointing. But I must say, her video that she produced um, was just blew me away. It was yeah. it was it was stunning. Spirit took one look at it and he was like, "We have to feature this." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. Which is lovely. It's so nice to have a mom like. Both the moms in the room here that are helping today with the setup is amazing. So it's always good to have parents that Shout trust in. Shout out to moms. Shout out to moms. <laughs> So each room at this event has got some kind of feature. I'm going to show you a few of them. So I've just walked into the one. This room here focuses, it's got its own little gaming machines. So you can play Pac-Man or one of the old vintage games that we used to play in our childhood, which I think is so cool. And it will obviously have the sound playing um, when the guests arrive. Slowly make our way through to the next room, which I'm going to show you now as well. And that room is... I do love this. I love this. So this room is covered in red, in red balloons. So when people walk through, they're just going to get a blast of balloons. How cool is that? And then you obviously get our fabulous room. You can see people are starting to arrive slowly but surely. 
Um, I'm going to give you a little bit of a look at the view from the Radisson at night, which is quite spectacular. What are you guys representing today? Uh, we are representing Bombay Bramble. Okay, and what is that? That's a it's a gin. It's a gin. It's a gin. It's a gin. It's, yeah. a, gin. it's a lovely gin. Mm -hmm. That's why we like you to try some. I will definitely try some in a bit. Thank you so much for the offer. I'll be no back. <laughs> How are you guys doing today? Good, how are you? Fantastic. So tell me a little bit about your experience so far. It's been fun so far. I'm loving the collections. Uh, this specifically has got a lot of movement. Um, I like the contrast of the colours. Very festival sort of vibe. Um, African eclectic. So interesting collection. It's been quite fun to model. Thank you. Amazing. And your name is? Stacy. Nice to meet you, Stacy. Nice to meet you. On to you, sweetheart. Hi. So tell me a little bit about yourself, your experiences with Radisson so far and the collection you wear. So I think it's very different to what we do usually, coming in here, getting our hair done like this. Um, to me, this gives off major like Hunger Games capital vibes. Like very... I feel like Katniss now about to go head to head in this one. <laughs> um, yeah, it's been amazing. Everyone's been so wonderful. The collections are so different and so inspiring and so creative and I think it starts really amazing conversations about where creatives in this country are going and, and the ways that we can take all the amazing talents in this country to another level. Fabulous, thank you. And we obviously have the models here modeling to Maya's pieces. Hi girls! Hello! Hey. How are you doing? Hello, I'm everybody. Fabulous. I'm fabulous. I'm fabulous. And I'm sure everybody is that's watching as well. <laughs> so let's start off. What are, what are our names? My name is Oluetu. My name is Punza. And you guys do belong to an agency. What is. Do you just model for the fun of it? We do model. I do belong to an agency. I'm, I'm an independent artist. Okay, fabulous. And what do you guys think of the collection you're wearing today? I'm loving it. It's giving me old school Gaga vibes when she was me dressing. Like. And, and it scream it, it it creates talkability. It's fame it monster. Absolutely, <laughs> yes. It creates talkability. I like the touch of um, rel religion conversation starter. The cues there. I think it's just controversial. I think it's discussions that probably need to be happening. And yeah, it's it's really makes me feel powerful. Also, it gives me. Send me what kind of vibes. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely, that's that's great. <laughs> and on yeah. to you, how do you feel? Yeah, just like all what has said, uh, for me it's actually giving me like a goddess folk vibe. So yeah, it's like very high fashion, something out of the box. I like the detail of the artwork. I don't know if you can like, see over here. This for me shows like like months and months of like work yes. uh, normally people just like see an artwork and then think oh it was just like two days Put but together. for me this like shows like the artist really like had time to like make this outfit and yeah like i said it's like i would name it like a goddess book <laughs> like, yeah, it's, like, amazing i feel like a goddess actually wearing it and yeah, it's like power. <laughs> yeah. Wonderful. And obviously, we're the best room at the Radisson, correct? Absolutely. I'm we are. Yes. <laughs> gorge, gorge, gorge. Thanks, girls. Thank you.
From all of us at the Viliati Fashion Institute, we would like to thank our patrons for their contribution towards the Fashion Education Foundation. Feel free to subscribe. The details to our patron account are listed below in our video description.